I'm launching a new education platform for blockchain developers and this is the story of why I'm doing it. So I've been dreaming of this project for a long time and it's finally happening. So listen to this story and watch until the end because there will be a surprise. If you are new here, I'm Julian and on Eat the Blocks, I help you to become a blockchain developer. So running your own SaaS is the wet dream of every software developer and I'm no exception. SaaS or software as a service just means a web or a mobile app that runs a service. So Netflix, AWS or Udemy are all examples of SaaS and you also have much smaller SaaS that performs a, a very specific service like indie hackers who run SaaS as a one-person operation and typically SaaS charge per month. So why is it so attractive to software developers like us? Well, with a SaaS, you have your own business, meaning that you can quit your job and be your own boss. With a SaaS, you can leverage your programming skills. And finally, with a SaaS, you can get recurring revenues. So running a SaaS has been a dream of mine for a long time, and I'm finally doing it. Long time ago, when I was still an employee, I was already dreaming of running my own SaaS, but I quickly realized that it was way harder than I thought. Because with the SaaS, you spend a long time working on a product without any guarantee that you have any customers. It's really scary. And, and I have to admit, I've been a coward. I let this fear get the best of me and I didn't even try but I still wanted to become an entrepreneur and I also wanted to leverage my coding skills. So this is why I first decided to become an infopreneur. So an infopreneur is someone who sells trainings like video courses. So I became an infopreneur by creating and selling courses for blockchain developers on Eat the Blocks. This is what I've been doing so far. As an infopreneur, I became a weaker coder. I became weaker because I was doing mostly easy tutorials and not production code. So I was still having SaaS fantasies from time to time, but with my weaker coding skills, this seems even less likely. And I realized one thing. I have every reason in the world to get back to production coding. First of all, it makes me more credible for my audience of blockchain developers here. And second, it will make me more confident if I ever want to launch a SaaS. That's why I went back to production. I went back to working as a freelance blockchain developer. And last month I made 30K from it. So it's pretty good. So now that I have my coding skill back, the next question is, what am I going to build for my SaaS? So when you build a SaaS, there are two parts, the product and the marketing. The reason why most indie hacker fail is because they don't like marketing. So they just don't do it. They just work on their product and they have no users and they give up. End of the story. But in my case, I have a big advantage because I already have this audience on YouTube. So if I decide to do a SaaS for this audience, well, I already have solved half of the problem. I already have the users. So now I just need to build something that they want. So I thought of different ideas. One idea was to build tools for crypto investors like trading bots or investment analysis app for crypto. Another idea was to build tools for crypto entrepreneurs, like a token creator. I might do some of these ideas in the future, but right now I think I have a better idea. My core audience is blockchain developers and I teach them blockchain coding. So could we do something related? In the past, I tried to do an education platform for blockchain developers. So uh, with a subscription, you had access to all my video courses. And this was pretty successful. A lot of you on my channel became subscribers of this platform and it was great. But I quickly ran into a huge problem. For a lot of these courses, I had to hire instructors to create them because I couldn't do them all by myself. And it was extremely difficult 
and painful because for each course you have to find an instructor so it needs to be a blockchain developer who is technically competent interested in teaching and who knows how to record videos and it's just not easy most developer don't want to create video courses they just want to code and i understand that also when i did this education platform it was a few years ago when the industry was much smaller so the pool of potential instructors for blockchain courses was much smaller so that's why it was really difficult to grow the catalog of courses that was one big issue the other big issue was how to keep the courses up to date because blockchain technology moves so fast a video course will become outdated in just a few months but making a video course takes a lot of time it can easily take you a few months that's why it's so hard to keep a video course up to date so in the end I decided to not continue in this direction and this leads us to now because now I have another idea I'm still not giving up on building a SaaS and I'm not even giving up on building an education platform I love education I think learning is one of the most powerful thing you can do every day I spend a few hours learning something new and I think everybody should do the same so what about learning programming? I will not do another video course. I want to innovate. So what can I do? One of the most popular courses I ever did was a course called 30 Days to Learn Solidity. People love that course. The idea was pretty simple. During 30 days, I give you one coding challenge per day. And after you try the challenge, you can see the solution. This is the best way to learn. You just have to do a lot of project of increasing difficulty. You don't have to spend like 40 hours watching some long ass video course. It doesn't work. It's just too passive. You have to actually code and solve challenges. And this is how I got the idea for my new project, the 30 day Academy. The 30 day Academy is an education platform to learn anything in 30 days. We will focus on blockchain first, but the concept can apply to anything. So on the 30 day Academy, you will have a series of 30 challenges and solutions. Everything will be text based. Text is great because it's easy to update so we can keep the courses up to date. Text is also great because it's faster to make than video which means that we can grow a huge catalog of courses. So we're going to have hundreds of courses on this platform. The V1 will be released for Black Friday on November 29. The first course will be a 30 day coding challenge for Solidity. And after you finish it, you will have a certificate that you can share on social media. And after that, we will quickly add new courses So for the launch of the 30 day Academy on Black Friday, there will be a special discount. So if you want to receive this discount, register with the link down below, you will receive the discount on November 29. So don't miss the date. I'm super excited about this project. I have very ambitious plans for the 30 day Academy. This is something that has been on my mind for a long time and I'm finally doing it. Uh, I'm not using any existing platform. It's all custom coded. Uh, and this is why we can have a lot of customization. The V1 will be simple. It will be coding challenges and the solutions. But later I will quickly iterate and add other features. So for the V2, I'm planning to use AI uh, to uh, give you some feedback. And once we have a feedback system, then we can have a leaderboard where you can see how well you are doing compared to other people. Uh, okay, so if you want to receive the special discount for the launch of the 30 day Academy, sign up with the link down below. You will receive the discount during Black Friday, which is November 29. All right, that's it for today. Bye.